Oh. From your weather authority, meteorologist Stacy May. Well, we have now had five days in a row with temperatures at or above 50 for our high. And today we were only one shy of hitting 60 for a high this afternoon. So we've been off to a good start here in the month of February. And for the most part, it is going to be staying mild and staying warmer than normal as we go through this week. It will be dry with a good deal of sunshine. It looks like Monday through Wednesday. Then we do have some rain returning to our forecast, but not until later Thursday, Thursday night into Friday. Then I think we'll get a break from the rain chances on Saturday. More rain chances return on Sunday. And then we may be talking about at least some colder air for the early part of next week. Doesn't look like anything too bad uh, cold-wise, but it looks like temperatures uh, will be getting more normal-like uh, for the early part uh, of February. So we'll look at that here in just a second. In the meantime, everything is quiet uh, on our live radar right now. And again, it is going to stay that way really for the next several days. It right now looks like it'll be at least later Thursday afternoon before any rain chances return to the tri-state. So it's a quiet Sunday evening, getting a little chilly out there, and it's been a little on the breezy side. You can see the pretty lights there, purple ones, uh, on the Blue Bridge right now, and then the lights of Smothers Park there, too, along the Owensboro Riverfront. And that is, of course, our Bill Morgan roofing and construction tower camera on the top of the Hampton Inn. And here's our view in downtown Evansville from the top of the Fifth Third Bank building, looking down uh, on the riverfront there. So let's check the numbers right now. With some clouds still in place across the tri state, it's just been kind of a slow fall through the 50s and now through the 40s this evening. And we're down to 46. Wind has come down a little bit, but a little breeze out there. And it's out of the north at 7 miles per hour. So that adds a little more of a chill to the air. And temperatures around the tri state. Kind of a bit of a range from some low 40s to still around 50 in Owensboro, 48 in Beaver Dam. Madisonville, though, you're a little cooler at 43. Morganfield, 42. Henderson, 45. Up in Princeton, it's 44. Same in Santa Claus, 45. Jasper, and over in Fairfield, uh, you're a little cooler at 42. And as we get rid of more clouds as the night goes on, those temperatures will be falling into and down into the 30s a little bit. So I think low to mid 30s is where we'll end up by early tomorrow morning. There are those clouds I was talking about. All the rain, as expected, stayed southwest and south of the tri-state today. But we did have the clouds kind of increase on us for a while this afternoon. We'll decrease them as we go through the rest of tonight. So here's an updated future tracker showing a clearing trend, but kind of showing it from northeast down to the south southwest. So by the time we get into tomorrow morning, skies should be turning mainly clear. And that'll give us a mostly sunny day for our Monday. And I think it'll be a little cooler than yesterday or than today, tomorrow, uh, but still warmer than normal in the lower 50s. And then tomorrow night will be clear in the evening. And then future tracker pretty aggressive, increasing the clouds later tomorrow night into Tuesday morning and then giving us clearing on Tuesday afternoon. Other models not quite so aggressive with the cloud cover tomorrow night into Tuesday. So I think we'll turn partly cloudy. Uh, heading into our Tuesday, but still a fair amount of sunshine on our Tuesday. Overnight tonight, it's clearing and it's cold eventually, lower to middle 30s. And then tomorrow, mostly sunny, a little cooler than today, but still not bad. We will take this 50 to 55 uh, for the high. And then will be our coldest day on Tuesday with a high of 47 and clearing skies. That doesn't last though. We warm it back up and warm it up more Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Mid 50s on Wednesday, a dry day with lots of sunshine. Then increasing clouds on Thursday, a windy high of 59. Rain chances return late Thursday. They continue and probably peak Thursday night into Friday morning. Diminish later Friday with a warm high of 62. And then a little cooler over the weekend with a dry Saturday and more rain chances on Sunday. All right, Stacy, thank you. Still ahead, a murder mystery in Indiana.